Q-tip time everyone, Mr. Q, your friendly neighborhood Qatari here, and today we're going to be talking about how to select the perfect sandal. Yes, us Arabs are the masters of sandals. Sandal masters, if you will. And to all of you Westerners who think that you are wearing sandals, sorry, those are flip-flops. Gucci flip-flops, make a kick rock. So, a lot of you might think that these are just normal sandals, but no. There are some very important things that you need to think about before selecting a pair. First of all, a lot of them come thick. So they're thick at the back, and it raises you so you can be a little bit taller. So I can look at Hamid in the eye. Hey man, I got my own! Sometimes I'll wear the good ones, and I'll be like that. I'm like, yeah, Hamid, how does it feel to be down there? Another thing that's very important to know is that from the inside, right over here, we've got some suede, soft fabric. If you get hot, gets hot outside, you want to make sure that this is nice and grippy. It's like sports cars. You know in sports cars, they give you like those nice Alcantara steering wheel so that if your hands sweat, it gives you that nice grip. Yeah, basically, we've got sports cars on our feet. <laughs> <laughs> Next up, you've got this part right over here. So this could be a faux leather or a leather as well. Sometimes they are flat, but I personally prefer the ones that have tiny little bumps, little dots. The reason is because it allows airflow to go through and I've got sweaty feet, so fact of the day about Mr. Q is feet sweat. Another thing is this part right over here. Now traditionally you might see a buckle, sometimes you will see nothing at all, sometimes they will be just simple straps, but this is more or less the traditional shape. It's got this Y right over here, and then you've got this one line on the top. This can come in many different types of fabrics. The one that I am holding right over here is carbon fiber. And of course, you've got some leather over here. I like it. Feels good. It makes me feel like I'm wearing a sports car on my feet. <laughs> now these go anywhere from 500 to 3,000 rials. So a lot of people will wait until it's sale season and then they'll buy loads of sandals and then like store them. Like they got like a storage full of sandals. Traditionally, you can get these sandals, especially here in Qatar, with ostrich leather. And you'll know it's ostrich because it's got these little dots on them. Not a fan of that myself, personally. I'll go with the carbon fiber. I'm modern. I'm young. I'm fast. I'm swift. And I like to wear sports cars. <laughs> and now, it's comment time. Lucas Hainsworth asks, What's the entry-level pen and watch like a simple Tissot or Mont Blanc combo? Well, listen. I've got Gucci, I've got Mont Blanc, I've got Mont Blanc. So there is no entry level, just buy whatever you like and looks good and preferably on sale. There you go. Life tips from Mr. Q. So thank you so much for leaving that comment. Don't forget, you can leave a comment below and you might just get yours read by me or Hamid or Aisha. If you like this episode, don't forget to give us a like. Of course, don't forget to share and of course subscribe and ask us questions so that we can create more episodes for you guys. Rest it up.